Hold on. This receiver's picking up some kind of transmission. Based on the signal strength, I'd say it's coming from inside this star cluster. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use this signal to lock onto its location and take them out. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to more Mass Effect. Hill here with Sindaria Shepard on board the bridge of the Normandy. We've traveled to the Vamshi system, searching for more Geth. We've arrived, or we are arriving at the planet Magi. Uh-oh, and we can land here. That's probably where the Geth are located, but let's go ahead and scan the rest of the system. Here's Almos. Nothing there. Pregel, or Pregel, however you want to say it. Okay, we have a Turian insignia while scanning the planet Pregel. You discovered several marker buoys orbiting it. Chief Engineer Adam secured some high-res optical images of the buoys, which appeared to have been neglected for some time. Each one was marked with the Baetica colony insignia. Pregel. Pregel. However you want to pronounce it. <laughs> Alright, that's it. There are just these three. Alright. Let's go back to Magi. Magi orbits the Vamshi binary giant stars. Vamshi A is a blue star of spectral class A4111 which burns at half again the temperature of Sol. Vamshi B is an aging red giant of class M5111, over 220 times the size of Sol. Do we really care about that though? Anyhow, Magi has a thin atmosphere of methane and carbon monoxide. The difference in temperature between the hemisphere facing the sun and that facing deep space causes constant wind, stirring the silica and sodium dust of the surface. Unsavory characters from the Terminus systems occasionally use magi for forms of cruel sport, dumping slaves, hostages, quarreling shipmates, or even, when bored, vicious animals on the surface. One must kill the other before they will be rescued from the lethal radiation of the giant stars. Alright. I don't know about you, but I'm frightened. Let's go. Let's get our landing party. Those are some pretty interesting, um, planetary, I don't know what you call them, summaries. They're, 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 they're interesting. All right, we're going with our same landing party, Tally Zora Naraya and Caden Alenko. Okay, planet fall successful. Well, you talk about crimson. <laughs> Okay, let's see what we've got here on the map. The Geth outpost is there. We have an anomaly in debris. Alright, we will go in our counterclockwise pattern to get to the Geth outpost. Wow, now this is certainly an interesting looking terrain. And look at the those stars that they talked about. Wow. Very interesting. I don't think the terrain on this planet is going to be nearly as bad as that of Chaska, I believe it was called. See, it's uh, something I've actually remembered because the terrain was just that uh, memorable. 
just steep and jagged and you know not something that you would expect to be able to climb all right what have we got here thorium got it all right let's head back we've got making plenty of credits here and I still haven't bought my Spectre weapon. Yes, sir. Oh, I'm sorry. Get in the Mako. Wait, did I set? All right. Well, anyway, I thought that was the marker. I guess not. amazing what you can do with uh, some filters. <laughs> I mean, this, this is really uh, pretty awesome looking, this red planet. Ancient debris. Is this safe? This looks like it might be a geth trap. Got it. This strange looking sensor has some ancient graffiti scribbled on it. It appears to be marked with the Edison colony insignia. Just how many colonies are there? All right, people. All right, we're headed to the debris. Let's do a save. There's no telling what might be out here. Wait. There's something else. That's not the Geth thing, is it? No, it's something else. Should be right around here somewhere. What the heck? Is that a... I'm seeing a, a creature. I don't know what that is. I'm on my way! What is this? An odd skull. Yes, very odd indeed. This massive skull is scored by deflective mass accelerator shots. The xenobiology files in your hardsuit computer can't identify the species. It must have been brought here from an unknown world. What on earth are we dealing with here? Is this familiar to anybody? I'm not sure. I... I recognize this species all right let's go hmm I'm still trying to piece together who had big teeth like that I'm sure this is something that I'm supposed to know. All right, debris, you're supposed to be here somewhere. Oh, wait, here it is. It's like everything kind of blends in together here. Crashed probe. Oh no. Got it. OK. 
Okay, a Kinetic Exoskeleton 9 and Inferno Rounds 9. We'll take those. We need stuff. I think we're um, really low on Omni Gel, so I'm going to need all I can get to convert to Omni Gel at this point. Yeah, those Geths have really been kicking my beep. <laughs> okay, here's a Geth outpost way over here. Yeah, we're going to have to remember, I hope I remember, if I don't encounter anything. Um, we need to level up. I think we've gone up several levels. I haven't checked that. I'm just trying to get this get stuff out of the way, because I tell you, these missions, I do not... Don't enjoy them. Oh, boy, there's more... Mineral deposits. see it. Must be at the very top of this mountain. Yep, here it is. Can we get out? Oh, we can. Beryllium. What? Caden. I think we got him, Commander. Caden, really? I'm thinking you might need to go back up on the Normandy. Must be hallucinating. close because I think I'm remembering lots of rocket launchers. Let's go ahead and do a save here. Well, we're not that close. Well, I don't know. Is that one of the... I see something in the distance. Okay, let's look at our squad. Alright, we are now at level 53. Um... I want advanced unity so we have more health and stuff when I revive these people. We'll just continue with more Spectre training. Okay. And let's see. Caden. Guess we will just give you more throw. Hmm. Is Master Throw enough? Can give you lift. That will help uh, get enemies out of the way. Okay, uh, Tally, we need you to have first aid. Okay. All right, let's continue on. I see some sort of uh dark object up here. Uh-oh. And the rocket launchers, but it looks like this is a mineral deposit. Now, can I get the minerals without being blasted to kingdom come? Oh, wow, it's a lot of uh, rocket launchers. But I think we can get this mineral. Magnesium. Got it! We are really getting lots of credits by getting these minerals. Okay. Let's go ahead and save here. Now where are all these 
rocket launchers. I'm probably going to run right into them. Okay, here we go. One down. Okay, that's two. Shields are still holding. Mm. All right. Got another one up here on the hill. Shields are still holding. I think we're at level 54. Looks like level 60 is going to be possible with these uh, alterations that we made to the Mako with the experience boost that we're getting when we kill in the Mako. So again, if anyone's interested in knowing how to do this, just you know, leave a comment and I will respond back with what you need to do. This is only on PC again. What you need to do if you only want to play Mass Effect one time to get to your maximum level because it does require Finally, so <laughs> it does require you to play through twice to get to level 60 under a normal playthrough like on console and whatnot okay other uh okay we got them all oh no okay all right shields are still holding and we cannot save I know there's uh, like a Colossus or something up in here. That thing right there. Isn't that it? So what is it's waiting for me to come right up on it. Wait, there's still we still got something else. a colossus. Ah, 
got it. This would be the main base of operations for this incursion. Hold on. This receiver's picking up some kind of transmission. Based on the signal strength, I'd say it's coming from inside this star cluster. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and take them out. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and take them out. Thank you, Caden. All right. Well, we barely got the Geth. At least our Mako didn't blow up. But all right. Um, we're going to return to the Normandy. But yeah, this is the, the thing that disappointed me with uh, this Geth incursion thing. It's like, you do all the incursions that you know about. Oh, we do need to... Well, we can just go back to the Normandy. We won't repair. Because uh, it'll be repaired the next time we use it. But you go through all this. And then there's... Oh, there's a main base that you have to take out. So, yeah. It's like, some of us are... are tired of the Geth and, you know, ready to move on with the rest of the story. But anyway, we're returning to the Normandy. All right, well, we have one last Geth base to take out, and we will do that, of course, in our next episode. This is Hill, and I'm out.